All right. People probably want to hear your thoughts on Cody Rhodes beating Sammy Guevara for the TNT title. He did not use a pedigree, though the setup was like the pedigree. He used a Tiger Driver to win the match. What you think of the match? And uh, where I, I, I'm actually interested in, in where they're going to go with this, but we can talk about that after. Okay, so as far as the match, I thought the match was great. Um, you know, Sammy, has, it's funny because it was the very first match on the very first uh, ish, uh, episode of Dynamite. And at the time, it was like a guy to go out there with Cody, Cody to get the big win on the first show, a guy who's a good young guy, you know what I mean, who, you know, would give him a nice match and everything. And now, I mean, which I really like was, was Sammy Guevara going like, you know, two years ago was this. And now, you know, you're the one who, who needs me type of thing. Mm -hmm. I'm the one who's going to carry the match. And Sammy looked great, and Cody was right there with him. Um, you know, I mean, as far as the decision – I'm certainly not negative on it. I mean, I think it opens up a lot of possibilities, um, you know, with what what the follow up's going to be. I mean, I just hope, um, hope like Sammy doesn't kind of fade. That's that's the worry, of course, uh, you know, because he's done so well and worked so hard. Um, you know, Cody's a lightning rod right now. And, um, you know, is that a good or a bad thing? I mean, there's people who definitely you know, hate him. And there's people who definitely, you know, still think he's a baby face. And, um, you know, I mean, it's, it's, in, you know, in, in every city, I get the reports after the show from people who are there. And it's just like, I know it sounds like he's booed, but you know, half the people are for him, if not, you know, but, but you know, the, the ones who hate him, like hate him and they're going to boo him like crazy. And that will happen. That will happen more now because he beat Sammy Guevara and, you know, he's, quasi you know they're all working with it they didn't understand the situation and he's very much a john cena thing you know and uh I, again like it, no he's not a drawing card at the level that john cena was um in the sense that if he's not on the card does it make 20 percent difference in the house no it does not um but but i mean i know people who were who would do the oh you know it's like it's what wwe did with john cena and it ruined the company and it's like John Cena was was the biggest draw in the business when when this was happening to him. Um, and and he was the biggest merchandise seller in the business when this was happening. So it's like that it's 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 not necessarily a bad thing because because of that. But um, but he's not John Cena. Like if he was John Cena and he was, um, you know, like the, the top, you know, like when, you know, when the merchandise is number one and when you're a ticket seller and everything like that, even if people boo you when you're the baby face and pe people get mad, oh, they should turn them, they should turn them. And then you don't. And the business is still good. Um, excellent, in fact, in a lot of ways, um, it's when you're at least when you're on the show. All right. Had a technical difficulty there. Hopefully my edit doesn't make it too bad. But um, you were talking about you know, the, the Cena thing and, and the Cody thing. Um, but what do you think about Sammy Guevara? Because when, when he, they put the title on him, I mean, he beat Miro who hasn't lost, but what twice. Yeah. And at that point I thought, Oh, you know, here, you know, we're getting this, this younger guy. He's got the secondary belt. He's going to defend it. He's a baby face. He's young. He's a good looking guy. Like there's something that I feel like maybe that there was a plan to elevate him, but I'm not sure if that exactly happened. Um, and then now, you know, now he's he's uh, lost the belt to the guy who's sort of already made and he's already the star. I, I just I, I feel like maybe Sammy didn't get as much out of it as I thought he could have in, in this title run. I agree. Um, I liked, would have liked to have seen it later than sooner, but, um, that was the decision made. Um, but yeah, I, I'm not against Cody being champion, but I would have liked to maybe, you know, but I, you know, seven weeks, but maybe they're looking, you know, again, I, I don't know the big picture of what they're booking or looking at or whatever, or think that. It's good to have him while his other show is on, you know, for cross promotion or um, they think it's because 
people are booing him so much and cheering him so much. He's become like the talk. So let's jump on that right now. I don't know. I don't know what the mentality is. I haven't really, haven't really asked, you know, as far as like, you know, why now? But, um, you know, I mean, it's again, like they usually do long title reigns. So sometimes when they do a short one, it's not necessarily the worst thing either. But for Sammy, um, I would have liked to, I would have liked for him for it to have been, longer but maybe you know two months from now if we look back and 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 there's no reason no viable reason there's nothing that comes up then i would say "Ah, why not why why didn't they just wait a couple months Mm -hmm. but 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 i don't know you know if there's you know i don't know what the situation is as far as like exactly where you know where they're going with cody right now or if they just feel like this is just the time to go with it um and that's the bigger picture more than sammy's the company and um Maybe, you know, I mean, there's just a lot of different things that, that could come into the decision. You know, you want you want to build people for the future. Um, at the same time, you don't you know, you want to build your current ratings now, especially when you're switching channels um, and focus on the better known people in a sense. But, you know, you're, you're doing both, you know, and you want, you, you know, again, you want a little you, you, you have to do both. You know, if you. Don't if you all go all with young guys, you'll your numbers will go way down for a while, and then maybe hopefully they'll go up at some point. Um, but you kind of want to mix, and um, you know it. And they are, you know, there's there's a lot of young guys that they're trying to push, and those guys aren't always going to knock it dead in quarter hour ratings. And sometimes, you know, you you may go in there and just go for whatever reason. This guy's not going to be the guy. And other times you're going to go that he's he just needs time, and you know you got to sacrifice because if you, you know, you, it's 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 a very difficult thing because people want you know next next Wednesday's rating, but really like for AW, um, the real important ratings are going to be when you negotiate the new deal. So that is going to be late 2022 and early 2023. So you want to peak for that. If you're peaking now and then you go down in that period, you're worse off than if you go, if you're so, so now, but then you peak in that period. So that's another aspect of, of, you know, like for right now, the idea is, is to get the biggest number, you know, essentially, you know, 10 months from now. That's like, that's when, that's when the real game is on, you know, and, you know, if they're ahead of WWE in 10 months, um, that would be, you know, the best thing possible for them. If they beat WWE a few times this fall, you know, and they, you know, whatever, and then it's there's you know WWE is clearly ahead in 10 months then that's not the greatest thing for them if you're a big fan of these video clips here on youtube you're missing out on full length shows down there on the bottom right hand side of the screen click that join button and when you sign up you'll have full access to all of the shows that we've got up on youtube over 300 at current count wrestling observer live the brian and Vinny show and figure four daily with filthy tom lawler and lance storm Hit the join button, sign up today. You can also click subscribe and you'll always be alerted as to when new shows and clips are available.